I want to welcome everybody to the WeBooks Leap for Literacy, third annual. I think this is really a testimony to the passion of this organization and the people who are involved in it and the community who supports it. So I think everybody should give themselves a hand right now. I remember three years ago, I was here and uh, had no idea what the whole leap was about. And somebody gave a few dollars and I jumped head first into the lake. And uh, uh, it wasn't bad but my pacemaker stopped for a second or two and then and then proceeded after that okay let's uh, recognize the we books community action team can we have those people identify themselves there they are uh, as i mentioned before the police will be here later to uh, to pick you up yeah now listen, uh, I had talked to Jane and asked her to arrange for a typical English spring beautiful day and this is what she got. So uh, just imagine you're sitting somewhere in England and everybody thinks this is a super day. So bright and sunny in England. Okay, we've got some judges and uh, I want to recognize them if they could step up toward me here. It's Jan Whetstone, owner of Jan's Daycare, and she's going to get a special award for doing this. I'm not jumping. She said she's not jumping, but pushing is okay. So she got something really valuable. I have no idea what it is. Okay. It's for Longhorn. Yeah. For Longhorn. Okay, Christy Haynes. Where's Christy, our, our super chamber leader? She's doing a great job, and uh, she also gets a, a freebie for Longhorn. So we do pay our judges, don't we? And the Honorable, and I use that phrase <laughs> loosely, <laughs> the Honorable James Grogan, Mayor of Dawsonville. Good to see him. You know, he has, he has done just a terrific job in the city, and... Uh, with his team, uh, things have really begun to roll. I think he has a re has a rejuvenation effort and plan working, and we'll see what comes of that. Good job, James. Okay, where's we got the picture? Where's uh, the Cybels? They're probably taking. There they are. <laughs> what? The other's in the boat, uh, John's in the boat, Mimi's right here. They have always been very generous in donating, donating their talents in photography, and they are, they are really terrific for photographers. So if you have any photography business you need done, they're the ones to see. Thank you. Okay. Uh, you, owe us, you owe me something on that, I think. <laughs> I'm, I'm keeping track of all those things. Okay, what else do I have? Chris Gaines. Where's Chris? Yeah, he's in the truck. And, uh, oh, there he is. He's our technical guy, and he's making all of this work. And uh, he's also on the city council and uh, doing great things with James. He's mayor pro tem. Whoa. That's pretty good. So we get the head guy and the next head guy. That's good. Anyway, thanks, Chris. He just had uh, twin baby boys about a month ago, by the way. So he deserves extra credit. Your wife was involved in that as well, I understand. Yeah. <laughs> okay, here's who we want to thank. We want to thank Kroger's. We want to thank Chick-fil-A. We want to thank Walmart. We want to thank Steamers for all these beautiful refreshments. So if you haven't gotten any, go get some. Go get you some. Now we got a dive team here just in case somebody doesn't come up. 
and it's the sheriff's department and the EMS. I don't want to get anybody frightened. Come on now. But uh, every once in a while, we get a floater, and we need to pull them out. Uh, I also want to acknowledge the park and rec department, and I guess we're on their land right now, aren't we? So they've done a great job of letting us do this. Uh, they asked us a lot of questions, but we've been able to, to get our way through that. But we want to thank them. Uh, Jane, she's my uh, trusty assistant here because now the fun begins and we're going to go through the order of participants. And we'll do the toe tappers first. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Thanks, Jane. <laughs> I knew she'd keep me on track, yeah. Look, there's some major sponsors, including all of you who support this effort. And, and you know what the effort is. It's to get little kids from one to five, I believe, from zero to five, that's pretty young, by the way, uh, who get a book every month free. And it's mailed to their house or wherever they're living, and they have a chance to have their parent or guardian, whoever's with them, to read them a book. It's all theirs. I've seen the books. Nancy has read them to me, and they're very good. So uh, this this team delivers these books to children and they get to begin to know the value of reading. They bring their parents closer together with them and it's just a wonderful, wonderful effort. So, the major sponsors of this group from a corporate or organization standpoint, I want you to listen to this. Amicalola EMC is a major sponsor. Sony EMC is a major sponsor. United Way makes a major contribution to this organization. The Nordson Corporation has awarded this group grants. So the Nordson Corporation has been significant. And, a, and Rotary International has been a major giver to WeBooks. And, uh, I'm part of Rotary and I'm very proud of our organization for the support we've given them. So uh, hopefully we didn't miss anybody, but I know you've all written checks somewhere along the line and we thank you for that. Let's go on to uh, the actual action. Okay. Okay, the first group to sacrifice themselves for this charity are the toe tappers and they're part of the Red Hat group of Dawson County. Dawsonville Red Hats. I got to get that right, or these girls will be all over me. And here they are. They're coming. Give them some cheers. Give them some moral support. All right, ladies. Are you going down to the water? Are you going toward the water? Eventually. This way. Our work is never ever done, but still we manage to have our fun. Helping get books in preschoolers' hands to make the smartest school children in all the lands. We Books, that is a name that everyone knows, and we paid money to dip our toes in this cold lake 
a love of books and reading we hope to make. And who are you? Face this way. We want to see the signs. Who are you? Oh, you're backward. Okay, that's good. <laughs> you're good. Thank you. <laughs> That was really cool. What did that sign say, anyway? <laughs> Dawsonville Red Hatters. Very good, girls. Dawson County Humane Society, who has a terrific team, plus they have some dogs with them. And I understand these dogs are available for adoption. Really nice. How many we got? Yes, Two dogs. Here they go. Watch them. I have no idea what the dog's names are, but uh, I assume they can swim. Carolyn Vaughn is the president of the Humane Society. She does great work and has that uh, Humane Society really humming. Okay, watch the dogs. This is where they jump and run and swim. There they go. Whoops. Yeah, go ahead. It's not that cold. Look, you got to wonder when a dog doesn't go in there. Uh, our next team is going to be the Dawson Community News. Watch this. Dawson Community News, reporters, editors. Look at that. How did we not call it all? Legs are Is it cold? No. Did she say no or yes? No. <laughs> here, here, here's the problem. Your legs are numb. That's your problem. Okay? And uh, our next one is the, uh, it's called We Needs. K-N-E-E-S, for those of you who uh, wonder what that means. And it's the women club, women's club of Dawson County. How many jumpers do we have? The whole club? Oh, only three. I mean, I don't mean only three. Three great jump jumpers. Beautiful ladies. Yeah. There they go. Nice, nice hairdo. They look brave. Yeah, there they go. Okay. It's almost like swimming, but not quite. Okay, swim to the boat now. Okay, keep going, keep going. Keep going, we're listening for screams. Come on. Oh, a little high there. Come on. We'll give a special donation if you go... Go farther. Okay. Nice job. Okay. Give him a hand. That, take, that takes bravery. Not only going in the water, but to have that thing on your head. There, the Women's Club is a major sponsor of We Read. We Books. Now these are the folks that work at Rick Rack, and if you haven't been at Rick Rack, you need to go there and you need to buy things and you need to donate things. This is one of the one of the most amazing facilities and organizations in our county. Uh, I see that they're getting ready; they're beginning to take off some of their clothes. I don't know how far this will go, but uh, we're going to stick around to see. Give them a hand because this is not going to be an easy thing. I've done it, I know. Tur team, turn around and wave goodbye. All righty, that's good. And uh, I think the pastor of one of our churches is near here too, isn't he? <laughs> Do we have a pastor or Ted Beard? We're looking for either of those. Oh, yeah. 
Uh, we do have uh, Ted Beard in the corner, is here. Well, that's good. Okay, team. It's all yours. Wow. There they're going. Oh, my God. Holy cow. And have they surfaced? Come on, everybody. Look, she's like, ah, look at that. Boy, those people are crazy. Sid Crazy, that's the name of this team. I don't get that, but they are crazy. Getting out of the water, by the way, is the hardest part. Nice job. Give them a new hand. Here, another hand. Both hands. Nice going. Nice job. Let's hear it for Rick Rack. They deliver. I know that. They pick up, too. We have an, another group lining up. They are the Interact Club from the high school. And Interact is a high school um, association that's connected to Rotary International. Rotary International has high school groups, high school uh, organizations, and they are called Interact. And as I mentioned before, Rotary is a major sponsor of We Books. So here's the team. They have the high school official uniform on there. Their name is Tiger Pride. Uh, Tony uh, Wooten, one of our police officer chiefs, whatever. Major, major. He's going to be jumping with them because he's the uh, the leader, the Rotary leader of their club. And he's jumping too. And and he told me he took he put his gun in his truck. Oops, I shouldn't say that. He doesn't have his gun on him. That's good. Because we don't know what would happen if he had that. So he's going to jump too. Are they ready? I can't see here. There they go. Tony Wooten, you crazy guy. He's a crazy guy. He's there. And uh, count to three and jump. One. Okay, there they go. <laughs> Tony! Tony! Okay. I'm over here where I can see you. Hey, sooner or later you gotta go. Who's gonna go first? Look at this, Tony Wooten. Come on, I think Tony. he needs help. <laughs> yeah. Getting out of the water is the hardest part, Tony. That's why I said the girls are coming over here. Yeah. Here he comes. They really don't have to He's got his wallet in his pocket. Hey, did you get your wallet out of your pocket? No. How about your cell phone? We should have mentioned that, by the way. Way to go, you guys. You did Boy, that's great. terrific. Let's hear it for them. This is the interact club from the high school. Barry Mays. Will Barry Mays step forward? Here he is. He's getting ready. He's doing a little stretching, a little exercise. Barry, take your cell phone out of your pocket. Take your wallet out of your pocket. Give me your wallet. That'd be good. Okay. We want nothing on your person except for just a few pieces of clothing. You can pick which ones. <laughs> now you're an individual jumper, so uh, we're going to score you as individual. And uh, I, uh, I think we applaud you. You're obviously a supporter of We Books. And look what this man is doing. Oh is there any last words you'd like to say to the crowd? No, uh, I think that's appropriate. Barry, when you get underwater, don't take a breath. There he goes! Did you see that? We've only had one other head first jumper in the history of the, and, and I don't think they made it back. Yeah, so uh, this was terrific.
Who is this guy anyway? I know. Barry Mays. Who knew? Hey! Nice going, Barry. Are you a are you a resident of Dawson County, Barry? You know, he showed up this morning. He heard about We Books. He was impressed with what they do and said he wanted to jump and made a contribution. Let's hear it for Barry. Barry, I believe you're a candidate for the board of directors, by the way. And, uh, you know, I think that the whole group would welcome you. Get yourself dry and show up for the next board meeting. Okay, who's next? We have a team called Three Blind Mice from Robinson Elementary School. I, I understand they are not students, they're teachers. Okay. And the school superintendent, Keith Porter, is with them. Keith has jumped every year for the last three or four years. He's, he, in fact, was the first jumper ever, and so this guy is really sick, okay? Now, I understand that this group, although they call themselves Three Blind Mice, they are really Mises. You know, they're the plural of mice. Three bl many blind Mises, okay? Are you, are you ready? I don't believe it. No, I'm here, I'm seeing no shaking of the heads here. They can't see where they're going, they're blind. Oh, I got it, yeah. Hey, give them a goose there and let them, oh, I shouldn't say that. Give them a little poke and let them go uh, down the line there. That's it. Do your job, Pete. Yeah. There we go. Oh, boy, she's got guts. She's got guts. Okay, now don't jump. Oh, keep going. Look at that. Uh, hey, look at Look at the big dust cloud that formed below Key. What is that? Okay, they're swimming in. At least a few of them are swimming in. Okay, here they come. So far, they're all breathing. These are teachers. We all should be very thankful for our teachers. Give my hand. Keith is floating back. Somebody get a hook. Yeah. yeah, somebody just told me that Major Wooten is in the ambulance. You go, yeah, girl! Getting, getting some oxygen or something. Mouth, somebody's giving him mouth to mouth. Okay. We got another one. Brian. Just. Brian. You know, he is a Rotarian. He's an Olympic swimmer, I understand. And he's an Ohio State Buckeye. The Ohio State University. He's going for a swim. He's a bike rider. He's a good guy. If you need your eyes checked, go to this guy. <laughs> Okay, Brian. Turn around. Let's see it. Bye. <laughs> He's pretty good for a Buckeye. Yeah, what is this? Are you doing laps? Okay, yeah. Look at, watch this. Oh, another head first guy. Oh, my God. Look at this. He actually knows how to swim. Yeah, yeah, back that boat up, quick. Make him go farther. All right, stop showing off, Brian. Yeah, he's a Rotarian. He was a Rotarian. But he's a great, what is he, ophthalmologist? Yeah. So if you have anything wrong with your eyes, or even if you don't have anything wrong with your eyes, go see Brian. Okay, because of that advertisement, Brian, you can write this whole thing off. Thanks, Brian. Get him a towel. Okay, wait a minute. This is much complicated. This is kissing, illiteracy, goodbye. 
This is the Donut Dawson County High School. Okay, we've got the leader right here. Good morning, Dawson County. Well, we had written a song for this morning back in the reading groove, but we didn't have it ready. So we did bring one of our oldies but goodies. We want to read all night and ride every day. That's the way I feel. Yeah. There they go. Aren't they pretty? Yeah, they're supposed to look like Kiss. You know who Kiss is? Yeah. They're, re and a, they're a really old rock group. <laughs> There they go. Wow. <laughs> Stick your tongues out. <laughs> yeah, now the time has come. Whoa. Yeah. Now it's not so fun, is it? <laughs> oh, boy. It's all over, kids. Nice boy. Yeah, let's hear it for They got a lot of guts. You get it. Not much sense, but a lot of guts. Yeah. Not so cold, is it? No. Nah. Okay. Oh I would you. Sure. <laughs> okay, now this is the last group. It's certainly but certainly one of the most significant. This is the junior Reds, which is a junior group for a group associated with the Dawson County Women's Club. How many are in this group in high school? Real quick. Okay. About 30, right? Yeah. About 30. How many do we have here from the group? Two. All right. But these are the bravest, I know. Grace. We signed up, but we have lost a few in the, in the process. Perhaps they didn't qualify. So here's, here's the juniorettes. Is there anything you'd like to say, girls, before you go? Hey. <laughs> Nothing. No, no words of wisdom. No. Chelsea, okay. go jump on this side. Like, I'm scared. Come on, let's go. I don't want to do it. No. Oh, never they're, mind. They're really good. No. Okay. One, take two, take three. the pictures. Turn around. Hey. Take there pictures. There they are. Wave. All right. We love you. Go Bray. See you around. <laughs> Here's Tony Wood, by the way. Nice going, girls. Good swim. You know, for a high school that doesn't have a pool, they can still swim pretty good. All right. It's cold. Okay. Is that the last of our... As they say in Wisconsin, that was the last of our yumpers. I'll bring my eyes in. Okay, we need all the judges the here. <laughs> okay, we have the results. They've been uh, they've been uh, kept in a jar, uh, protected by Funk and Wagnalls. Isn't that the old <laughs> the old saying? Something like that. I don't know. Okay, the results are the best leaping team is. Go to commercial. <laughs> the best leaping team is Interact. Yay! Let's hear it for them. All right. Come on up. Come on up. You got to come up once more. Tony! Tony! The checks are all big, so you want to be up there to get it. Yeah. Here they are. Get Tony up here. Look at this. Tony! Tony! Yeah. Don't get these guys upset because they're all big. Okay, nice going. And what do they get for winning, by the way?
A handshake. That's it. Oh, I see another donut. First place is another donut. Actually, second place is two donuts. Okay, thanks. Nice going. Okay, thanks, guys. Good job, bro. Nice job, guys. Okay, here we go. The next team for recognition is the most creative team. And uh, I think you'll all agree with this because the team is, let's see your tongues, girls. Kiss! Kiss, yes. Yeah, that's it. Look. Anybody who gets up on a Saturday morning, paints their face, puts on a wig, and comes and jumps in a lake, we really need to have their uh, their background check. I think. Okay, good job. Okay, nice going. Again, the coveted extra donut prize. Okay. Oh, this one's good. This one is the highest sponsorship team. Does everybody understand that? Okay, the highest sponsorship team. That's That means more dough. That team is Robinson. Elementary school. Are you collecting for everyone in the school system? Where's Robinson? Yeah. Okay, Keith. Where's the sword? He lost the sword. Okay, he lost his tail. What happened? Okay, these were three blind mice. They certainly are. Nice going. Go home and get, uh, get warm. Nice job. That was great. The highest sponsorship team, do we know what the number is? $750 odd dollars. That's pretty good. That's at least a payday in the school system, isn't it? At least. Okay. Okay, now we go on to individuals. The best leaper. Okay. This is something that really is nice. This is the guy who showed up. Nobody knows how we found out. He donated and jumped. I mean, that's this guy. That's his attitude. He's great. Barry Mays. Let's hear it for Barry. The newest board member of We Read. We Books. We Books. Yeah. Keep me on track with that, by the way. Hey, Barry, come on back. Yeah. You may be a candidate for commissioner. Yeah. Yeah, by the way, do we see any other commissioners here? Do we have one? Oh, no, they stayed home. It was too bad. The weather was too bad. Okay. Most creative. That's what, that's what it is. Okay. Most creative. Uh, I don't know if you would have uh, guessed this one, but you know we had one Buckeye, as I as I recall, in the whole jumping. Who was the Buckeye that jumped? Oh, we know. Come on. Do you all know who the Buckeye is? Yeah. It's Brian Burke. Look at him. He's the tallest guy in the crowd. I can tell. Did you run out of awards? Did you just we ran. Out of Sorry, Brian. We ran out of awards. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No. Here's the reward, Brian. You get all of the donuts that are left. Yeah. What a guy. He's great. Thank you. He's also a uh, very accomplished bike rider. And rides these 100, 200, and 300 mile bike rides. He's crazy. Okay. Now, anybody who went in the water, put a toe in, even thought of jumping, I'd like to have everybody give them a hand because that's what makes this whole event worthwhile. And there is a certificate for anybody who participated. See Marsha. Yeah, she's got him. Now, I think we're almost at the end of the uh, event. 
and uh, I'd like to thank everybody for coming, really. This is, uh, I think compared to the first year, it's probably two or three times the number of people. Next year, I think it's going to be even bigger. Um, think about it during the year. Uh, all those who jumped, how cold was it? It wasn't that cold, was it? Nah. Okay. Go home, have a toddy, and we'll see you next year.